Hello, I'm James Judd, very happy to be back working with this wonderful Slovak Philharmonic Orchestra. Do hope you'll join us on March the 3rd or 4th because we're playing a beautiful program, Classical Music. The second half features Mendelssohn's uh, Scottish Symphony. It's the Symphony No. 3. And it has a very special place in the, the core repertoire of classical music because somehow I think it's perfectly poised between the classical era and the romantic era. It's music that has incredible rhythmic classical discipline, but it's also music that's bursting into the romantic era, era full of imagery and romantic impulses. So a very special work on the second half. On the first half, we're playing another symphony from the British Isles, I suppose you could say. We're playing Haydn's Symphony 104, which was nicknamed, it's one of the London symphonies, and it was written for the famous Salomon Orchestra in London, and um, was a great success, the first performance. The first performance in London, I think Haydn himself directed it. And uh, before the Haydn Symphony on this program, we're going to play a somewhat neglected overture by Mozart. It's the overture to the opera La Clemenza di Tito. On March the 10th and 11th, do join us in the Philharmonic Hall to hear this gigantic and beautiful, profoundly beautiful symphony by Bruckner. Of all the Bruckner symphonies, in fact, of all the repertoire we play, of all composers, Bruckner Eighth Symphony has a very special place. It's an, a symphony which has a great belief. It has a great belief in the human spirit. It doesn't matter whether, like Bruckner, you were a great religious believer. Whatever you believe in, you believe in the human spirit, you believe in um, the human's ability to survive and to reach another place beyond the earth. Um, this music takes us there has one of the most beautiful adagio slow music in all of music. This is the only work we will be playing on those dates because it, it really does exist as an experience all in itself. So please do come and join us for Bruckner Eighth Symphony on March the 10th or 11th.